Hey humans, right, so this was a job I did the other day. Um, I just wanted to add this bit before we got going. Um, don't, <laughs> everybody's going to get their bloody knickers in a twist over this one. So I just wanted to say before you watch this, yes, I know copper grease is petroleum based and it all swell seals and you don't want to put it on a brake caliper and it's the worst thing you can ever do. It's just a load of bollocks because in the real world that's not how it works. CU800, this Worth product I've been using for years and years is absolutely epic on brake calipers for keeping the corrosion off the dust seal. It doesn't affect the dust seal. Um, I've experimented in the past and just like got an old dust seal and left it in a blooming jar of CU800 for weeks. It makes no difference to the seal whatsoever. It doesn't swell the seal. I don't think I'd want to put it all over the waterproofing boots and that sort of thing on the calipers but where it comes into contact with the dust seal just um, in the caliper body between the piston and the caliper body it's perfect for that application to keep the road salt out anyway thought i'd add that enjoy hey guys i thought i'd share this with you just very quickly ah, the copper grease debate now we know everybody's got an opinion about this those of you that have watched my caliper servicing video will know that i'm a fan of especially in the uk misting around the piston with some worth cu 800 um this caliper i just wanted to <clears throat> show you this example so this bike is a it's a 600 hornet it's been used every day through the winter it's absolutely hanging you can see actually there that seal's failed um where the <clears throat> caliper slides on the pin and has let the weather in you can see how exposed it's been to the salt and stuff this piston let me just try and do this one-handed so that was misted in copper grease at the beginning of the winter if we clean the piston up underneath that copper grease is a shiny piston I'll just give it a quick wipe with some brake cleaner and I'll be back and I'll show you how it's kept the weather out from the from the dust seal so yeah just giving it a bit of a wipe so you can see how well protected the pistons been how clean that aluminium is uh, and that groove between the caliper body and the piston you can see the weather hasn't been able to get in there that's the point of failure if you like with a brake caliper the weather gets in underneath that first seal you can see there the dust seal and causes a load of corrosion behind the seal and the seal squeezes down onto the piston if you look around this side you can see where the copper grease has sort of sunk into that groove between the piston and the caliper body and it's kept the weather away probably not necessary if you ride in the summer and don't see any road salt but certainly for the UK it's a good idea that for protection anyway over and out so there she is she's had a bit of a clean and then if I can film this and do it at the same time you don't go crazy but you just you just dust around it so the copper grease sinks down into that groove between the piston and the caliper body. Does that make sense? That keeps the corrosion out. Obviously as the pads wear that piston moves out but that copper grease tends to stay seems to stay sat down in there and uh, yeah that piston and caliper body after a winter in the UK used every day it would not look like that if it hadn't been protected. Cool man beware of people dressing up opinion as fact this is the real world this is how it works in the real world yes I know in theory you shouldn't use copper grease on a caliper anyway my two penneth take it easy guys see you again